G'day guys, this is Stu from Scope Down. Today we're looking at the Infrared Eye E3 Plus Thermal Monocular. This monocular has a sensor size of 384 by 288 pixels. So that's the overall amount of information coming into the screen. It's got a pixel pitch of 12 microns. So that's the overall size of the pixels. It's gonna be a little bit smaller, a little more compact, and it's gonna give you a smoother image. It's got a thermal NETD of less than 25 millikelvin, which is gonna give you lots of information in between the thermal readings. The IE3 Plus has an objective lens of 25 mil with a field of view of 10.5 by 7.9 degrees at base magnification. This unit has an optical magnification of 3.5 and then it's got a digital magnification of up to four times. So overall, you'd be able to get this out to 14 times magnification. The overall detection range for a car size thermal target is 1300 meters. The IE3 Plus has got your four standard color palettes. It's got your white hot, black hot, red hot, and fusion. Just to give you a quick rundown of the unit, we've got the diopter adjustment up the back end. We've got your magnification dial as the first button. So if you click this in, it'll bring up all your different image adjustment settings. So your contrast, your brightness, and your different filters. And then if you hold it down, it's going to bring up all your internal settings. Just ahead of that, we've got your camera button. So that if you hold it down, it's going to take a picture. And if you click it in, it's going to start recording. And then down the end here, we've got your focus dial next to the objective lens. Just some neat things to note about this monocular is that it does not have a power button. As soon as you flip down the lens, it's going to register that you have opened the unit and it is going to turn itself on. It'll be the exact opposite for when you close it up. This thermal also uses a nifty little magnetic charger. So it's just as simple as popping it on like that. It's good to go. It's got a few internal settings, which are pretty interesting as well. It's got an adjustable compass for you to use. It's also got a hue setting inside, which will make the display either warmer or cooler, whichever is more compatible with your eyes. And lastly, it's got a focus mode. So it blurs out the rest of the screen, but has a small circular cutout in the section, which will have a largely increased contrast, which gives you an extremely sharp image in the center of the screen. That was a quick look at the Infrared Eye E3 Plus. I'll see you in the next video. You have a good one.